Hello, everybody! Welcome back to the finale of Let's Play Battalion Wars 2! In this part, we're, as I just said, we're doing the finale, as in, we're going to begin the hardest and last mission of the game, The Reckoning. Kaiser Vlad is close to finding the Staff of Kalen, the Solar Empire's ancient doomsday device. The Alliance of Nations launches an all-out assault on Vlad's glacier excavation facility in a desperate attempt to stop him once and for all. Yeah, look at the odds against us. They got grunts, heavy tanks, battle stations, gunships, fighters, and strato destroyers, and all we got are a few anti-air vets, some gunships, and a battle station. I will say one thing, though. The battle station in for the Tundra Territories... It's actually pretty easy for it to get destroyed. I don't, I don't, I'm not lying to you. It's also weird. This is the only game, this is the game where the battle station being destroyed doesn't count as a game, actually counts as game over. Huh, weird. But this is actually a really hard mission. Of course, albeit because it is the last mission. But this battle station, I don't know. It's very powerful, yes, but it's very fragile. It's pre this battle station is pretty much a glass cannon. The staff of Kalen lies here in this glacier. Soon my mining spider shall extract it, and I shall wield unlimited power! Kaiser Vlad must be stopped, Commander. We have to get to that mining spider! Oh, look at all those troops and battle stations! Commander Übel! Delay the marshal so that I can complete the process of extracting the staff! At once, Herr Kaiser! Any survivors will join their comrades in Ubel's POW gulags! <laughs> Just like the Solar Empire to get captured. Our allies must not endure the indignity of capture. Liberate these Imperial anti-air vehicles! And free these Frontier POWs from Ubel's vile clutches, Commander. It is up to you to unite the Alliance of Nations. Defend this Tundran radar array. It will be needed to safely guide gunship reinforcements to your positions. All right, here we go. The Tundran Battle Station, but do not let it be destroyed, for nothing else can smash the mining spider. And it begins. The final mission of the game. This glass cannon is all that can t the only thing that can take out the battle station. We will be hit by gunships and heavy tanks. Don't worry, the battle station is more than enough. Did we seriously just lose a troop already? Alright, there goes takes care of that. Here comes some more gunships. Heal up. Heal up as often as possible in this mission. Move forth, comrade commander. I repeat, heal up as often as possible in this mission. Enemy battle stations emerging from the field. <laughs> I shall send in my personal gunship attack squadron. Fire! Fire! Shoot! All right, now take out that second battle station. Look at the damage I've already taken! Whew! Uh, you're gonna be seeing this health go up and down, up and down, up and down throughout this entire mission. I'm probably gonna redo this part because it's easy to die. Marshal, my expeditionary force at the Northern Radar Array is coming under heavy fire. Oh, come on! Not another one! Protect the Northern Radar Array. If you are successful, we can use those grounded gunships. A valiant effort. The 
radar array is safe. Those additional gunships can now lift off. And as you saw right now, or as you can hear, you can take direct command of these tanks too. We're only going to beat these Xers if we fight together, right? Alrighty, so here is our battlefield. I, did, I was just very pressed and urgent, but now we have a chance to breathe. Here is the battlefield for the mission. Here's the ice station. To take care of it, we have to take care of these shield generators. Yes, shield generators. If you can see, look at all of these troops that are protecting it. This thing has several heavy tanks, two battle stations, grunts everywhere, fighters, gunships. Over here, we got more battle stations. We also have more heavy tanks. Heavy tanks galore throughout those battle stations. Heavy tanks, grunts, grunts, heavy tanks, battle stations, MG, RPG towers, anti-air towers, the works. All I'm gonna say is, we're gonna be losing. We're gonna be up for a heavy challenge, and this is why this is the hardest mission in the game. Ah, oh, just like the Solar Empire, they have the units completely worthless. You also want to make sure you keep your anti-air vets alive throughout this, because these gunships will probably take care of your entire attack force before you even get to the first Gulag. I'm sure your gunships could probably take care of them, but you would be probably be suffering heavy losses, and I think they're default to attacking your battle station first. Alright, our gunships stay behind. I should have everyone stay behind. And we're gonna take care of this anti-air tower and then clean out with gunships. What anti-air tower? I don't see any anti-air towers. Do you see an anti-air tower, guys? I don't see an anti-air tower. Do not go in with your entire battalion. You want to make sure you clear these out with gunships first. They have battle stations in here. I believe each Gulag has at least one battle station in it. A crap ton of heavy tanks and a bunch of other ground... Um, RPG tower. So heading in with gunships is much better than heading in with your battle station and tanks and troops and all that stuff. Be sure. Oh, I was wrong. They actually do. Some have two battle stations. Actually, no way. Both of them have two battle stations. Take care of the battle stations. Do not let them attack me. I believe the battle station salvo can take down a gunship with one shot. It will heavily weaken it. You're not pressed for time with this. You don't have to worry. However, you will be... Uh, it's a bit of a challenge, and I guess we can call in the battalion right now. Alright. Empty tower's good. Alright, take care of the ammo dump. Some free to Solar Empire units. Battle station, you are now under my command again. And now we got Solar Empire Unit, and that, since we commanded all three, we are no longer taking command of the Tundrans. Our symbol changed, and now we're taking the care of the Alliance. Which is pretty unique. I like how they made that change for this mission. It still doesn't excuse the absurdity of hard that this mission is. Trust me, you have to be a really good commander. You have to know what units to use. You have to know where to place your units, how to keep your units alive, and what units are good against other units if you have any chance, any chance of beating this. Oh, crap. Um, can I heal, please? Something to heal with. Heal. Heal. Thank you. Granted, this mission's actually somewhat pretty short, but actually, no, I'm wrong. This mission's a good length. Two heavy tanks and their crews are being held prisoner in the gulag ahead. And come more gunships. Here they come to break the day. And that, there go the gunships. Let's see if we can take care of that anti air tower. See if this is a good enough range so I have to aim higher. Aim a bit high. Uh, here comes another one. Go away! Uh. Keep your eyes open. The gulags are well protected with an anti air tower. 
I see you, Grunt, over there. You don't think I can't? Don't think I can't see you. Does this thing actually rock? Oh, it actually rocks the battle station mag quartz a bit. Come on. Ooh, health. Okay, good. All right, now we'll send in the gunships. Wait, was there a second anti-air tower? I forgot. MG tower. MG tower. MG tower. Battle stations. Grunts. Much easier pickings. Gunships, take care of the battle stations. Let's just hope it doesn't spot our battalion and decide to ignore us and go after it. Alright, that takes care of that battle station. And we'll take care of the MG towers over here. Because we have more heavy tanks, which will be helpful, I guess. We'll see how they need much help. Eh, I guess it would be helpful in taking care of some heavy tanks while I'm focusing on something else. Alright, and with that, that is done. Alright, take back command of the battle station. Why is the battle station all the way over here? Is the driver drunk or something? Alright. Battalion, form up. Very good. Alright. Free those POWs. I said, let's free those POWs. Frontier heavy tanks from the Western Gulag. Secondary objective complete. Alright, so we have four heavy tanks, four anti-air vets, two... You did it, Nova! The heavy tanks are yours to command. Go, Alliance of Nations! When the... Did I jerk in? Ah, game! Uh, we'll have our gunships take care of that heavy tank, just because I don't want to risk my battle station taking too much damage. Alright, gunships, take care of that one. Aha, I thought you could hide from me, huh? Well, you're wrong. Nothing can hide from the almighty battle station. Even though this thing still is a glass cannon. It's still an epic glass cannon. I'll say that. It's an awesome glass cannon. I love this glass cannon, even if it's very, very weird looking and everything's all cramped together. I don't care. I love it. Let's see if we can take care of this heavy tank. That way we don't in initiate the cutscene. Alright. Gunships will stay behind because, of course, we have they have fighters up ahead. Actually, you know what? Gunships, you, can you take that out? Okay, good. Very good. You, Kate, you stay behind just until we deal with the fighters. Now, take your time up here. You have to take your time because I don't know if these units get reinforced or the units here they when they die, when you take care of them that does it. But you do not want to immediately go after these shield generators. Trust me, you do not want to. You want to make sure you take care of all ground and air units before you do that. The enemy approaches my mining spider. Oh crap! Ramble the remaining gunships and fighters to hold them off. Oh wow, I did actually hit with the metal stick. Ow! Ooh! Uh gunships! Gunships! Heavy tanks! Everyone! Kill the battle station! I am in so I am in the red zone right now. Hey, <laughs> get it, I'm tender of red. And an intentional joke, not needed! Ow! You went know screw it! All units attack! Gunships, take care of the battle station! Heavy tanks, you take care of that heavy tank over there! I need to heal up! I need provisions! I need A and NTR to take care of those! Alright, battle stations are taken care of! Wait, was there a second battle- was there a third? No, good! All battle stations are taken care of, sir! All present account for, sir! Now we get to begin the long and drawn out process of taking care of all the land units. Please, please tell me that they have some tents over here I can probably take care of to get some health. Uh, 
take care of that fighter, please. Thank you. Did we lose a gunship already? Uh, I guess we can take care of one generator. One generator, you, so long as you don't destroy all three, it will not initiate the cutscene. And trust me when I say, you do not want to initiate the cutscene until you're perfectly ready. And good, there's tents. Uh, these fighters are really starting to annoy me. Alright, good. I don't trust that fighter. I just know it's gonna screw me on my gunships. Maybe it's not, maybe we're out of range and one gunship is about ready to go down. Alright. Health. All units, freeze! My health. And good. Alright. Take care of it with all no, there's still a heavy tank, a few grunts, and a gunship, and a fighter out. Alright, take care of those, and we will begin the cutscene. I'm sorry. I'm not gonna say- I'm not gonna say it until I finish the mission, because I know that will just jinx me and just screw me out of victory. Gunship. 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 Where's the gunship? Gunship. Gunship. There's a gunship. And there goes the gunship. Alright. Pretty good. I'll take care of that fighter before we uh, begin our attack on the mining spider, which actually looks a bit smaller than it usually did. It originally did. I don't know why they scaled down a bit. Take care of that generator. Wow, it's like Red Square, or whatever that thing where that guy stood in front of the tank. He was like, YOU SHALL NOT PASS! Only one remaining. Alright, uh, alright, take care of that fighter. Wow, that pilot's life must suck right now. Alright, good. Alright, every A take command of this, just in case we haven't played the Solar Empire in ages. We've got our gunships, and we are going to fa- Where did you come from? Actually, no, I think it- Oh, crap, it does spawn more units. Okay, well, I guess I'm not gonna do the trick. I guess I can save the Frontier Tanks. And we'll say the gun we'll say the gunships too. Actually, you know what? No, we'll we won't say the gunships. The gunships will actually be helping us. We're gonna move our anti air vats and our tanks way out of the way of this. Trust me, you will lose your these men if if we keep them up there. Oh no, keep them there. Very good. All right, battalion is ready. Let us. Why was I taking damage? Why was I taking damage? Oh yeah, gunships. Uh, can I heal up, please? Any health, please? Thank you. Alright, generator. Generator. Alright. Here we go. What? The shields are destroyed? All Strato Destroyers reports to the Mining Spider immediately! And here comes the pain. Strato Destroyers, eh? These fighters will help you deal with those fiends. So yes, yeah, so you thought the Angle Isles weren't gonna help us out? You'd be wrong. Only our battle station can bring down the spider. Drop it, fire! Alright, the spi Mining Spider is gonna shoot lasers at you. But you won't take so much damage so long as you keep moving. Wow, that's not an obvious reference. You know, kind of, it actually does remind me of the Emperor from Star Wars. I mean, think about it. 
How much he quotes him? How much he's always like this evil mastermind plotting in the shelves? Vlad's the freaking Emperor from Star Wars! Fortunately, the gunships are helping with a good distraction. So long as you also circle strafe around this thing, and it will not hit, will, will hit you not a whole lot. Crap! 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 I'm in stock! I'm in stock! Fall back! Why am I in stock? Ow! Game, please! Crap! 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 Game. Fire. Fire the spider. Kill the spider. Spiders are the creatures of the... Spiders are spawns of the devil. I just lost the last of my fight. It's great. You know what? You focus on distracting that. I'm gonna continue circle strikes me. Victory is at hand. The battalion's working good unison. Very good. Alright, good, good. We're doing good. We're doing good. We almost got it. I'm about ready to lose another tank. I just lost another tank. I'm already lose both my tanks. Oh, there goes the frontier and uh, Anglos. I thought this the Solar Empire and me, which is weird. The, the worst nation in the game is the one that actually survived the mission. I did it in one try. The mining spider is destroyed, but no matter. I have found the Star of Kalen. And now it is activated! I shall destroy you all and escape by air transport! Not if I shoot it down first, old chap. Trapped! Quickly, Uber! We have but one chance to escape! I've got a bad feeling about this. Out of the frying pan and into the fire. Hey, Betty. Hop aboard. Looks like we're in for some turbulence. Hang on! Again, I am denied my right of vengeance. Where are they? Keep digging, Commandant. At once, Herr Kaiser. for Exylvania. <clears throat> Will you have another match?
Alrighty, so what is my score for this mission? Wow! Wow, final mission, and I got the lowest ranking ever! I, uh, but you know what? I honestly don't care! I actually managed to beat it in one try! Alright, so let's see. Power! Uh, and next to me in Stroud Destroyer was left. But was. We still kept one of their air units, so I believe it was a Stroud Destroyer that the troops didn't uh, take down in time, or maybe it was a fighter that spawned. Speed! Ouch! Wow, that is my lowest speed score so far. 17 mi You had to beat this mission in, what, 11 minutes to get 100%? Jeez, gang, can you pl please... <coughs> Sorry about that. Can you please be a little bit more merciful like you were in the past? Technique, we lost... Oh, we lost... Two infantrymen? Oh, I didn't notice that. Uh, we lost... Uh, we lost a lot of ground units, mainly it was our, um, the heavy tanks that we lost. And we lost all our air units, but their sacrifice was for the greater good. So I'm sorry for you brave men that died in your gunships and tanks, but trust us, it was for the greater good. The greater good. Alright. So, with that, Battalion Wars 2! has been completed and I will say one thing about this game is I didn't like it as much as the first game which is understandable I mean sequels don't usually compare as good to the prequels and yeah I mean I'm happy that they made the camera controls the uh, aiming all that stuff commanding all, all that much easier the, they gave the Legion its own campaign which is also very good but at the same time, they still didn't make an main campaign! No, not that. Uh, it's just that the story seemed a bit... Uh, how do I say this? A bit simpler. I mean, the story in Battalion Wars 1 was really good. The story in Battalion Wars 2, it, it was okay. But it, at the same time, it was a bit more simple. Granted, I... If you're thinking I hated this game, no, I did not. I far from it. I still love this game. I still love this series. Hell, I am still waiting for Battalion Wars 3 to this day, and I've heard that they put it on the Wii U because you could really do some stuff like the Wii U board could help like command troops better. People who are d developers of the game, if you're listening to that, here is an idea for you. Make the Wii U thing able to make your troops command better. You can put them wherever you want on the battlefield. And with the touchpad, and hell, I would actually be there at E3 to for unveil PAX Magfest, whatever the hell it, it is where they showed off the stuff. I would personally promote this game. I do promote this game. This is a great game. People need to give this game a try. It is a very, very, very well thought out, well executed game. The series is amazing, and I'm still waiting till that. Until they put Advanced Wars, which I still haven't played. I know, Blasphemy, he played Battalion Wars, but he never played an Advanced Wars game. They m should make Advanced Wars for the 3DS market. You should really consider that, because think about it. It's a good game, it's a strategy, it's a good time, time spender. And it's also, with the Wi-Fi and all stuff, it could put some very good head-to-head -head matches. But, you know, with all that stuff, none of... Here are all the voice actors. Tom Clark Hill, you have an awesome voice for the infantry. I believe, wasn't, isn't he the same guy or was some guy, but I remember back in Battalion Wars 1, one guy did the voices for all the infantry. Uh, I still love this game. I still love this series. This is still one of my favorite RTSs of all time. And, uh, yeah. Alright, so for Nintendo, Shitaku Tawata. Producers, all that stuff, supervisors, I would actually help you guys build the next game. I would, after all, you need to make a third game to detail what happens. You cannot leave a game on such a cliffhanger. Please, please make Battalion Wars 3. But, with that said and done, I'm the Big Game Hunter, signing off with the credits finally rolling in. And I will see you all back in Paper Mario, The Thousand Year Door. Later.